Hi right, everybody, I'm just going to do your video feeding my blue throat triggers. Um, I've got this little like white bait from the fish shop. Um, you defrost it in a glass, you put it in the freezer, then you can pick them out, defrost it in some warm water, like a, like a normal fish food. And I was contemplating start doing it, feeding them. <laughs> I, I, put the, I put the food in these clips. Um, mm. And then I was feeding my tangs by hand, the seaweed, but I'm a bit scared of doing the trigger fish. If you see how they eat them, I'm going to take a bite out of my finger, that'll be it. So I'll just get it in the tongs and I'll get the camera up close and show you them devouring the white bait. These are the best things for feeding the uh, anemone. They get a bit stuck with the salt water. Uh, Hold on, Jake. Hold on. Right. You ready? It's the female that um, does the most eating, that's the male there, not focusing very well. Um, she's a bit camera shy, that's her there, look. She's scoffing, at, she's scoffing nearly that entire thing. There it was, gone. That's the female there. But she's uh, she doesn't like the camera. Uh, May always the blue cheek there. They're all getting a nice size now. I'll put the rest of the food in. That's a mix of brine shrimp, mysis and two different sizes of quill chopped up into little blocks kept in the freezer defrosted and then everyone gets a bit we had a bit of a change around the tank bought some more living rock tried to move that anemone back okay that's the feeding the blue throat trigger Thumbs up if you like it, subscribe if you like.